Yo, what is up YouTube with your boy Breezy Kicks, the sneaker feed. Now today we got the LeBron John Elliott in the black colorway, but before we get into it, make sure if you're new to the channel, subscribe, hit that like button if you like the content. Make sure you follow me on IG at Breezy underscore Kicks 23. Again, it's your boy Breezy Kicks, let's get it. Most of the time when these people be talking, I don't even hear them. I don't. They talk and they talk, but I do not hear shit when I'm near them. So, we got the LeBron John Elliott icon. Suggested retail $250. We got this all black Nike box. Pretty much the same as the Jordan 1 box, just all black. The icon John Elliott LeBrons. I don't get it. How are people sleeping on these? They killed it on this. I. I'm so impressed with this shoe. The look is on point. It's a collaboration. Quality is A1. I mean, this is a nice, comfortable sneaker. Uh, it's iconic because of the LeBron model that they're using. 250, that might be the problem. That I think the retail being $250 is what killed this shoe. If it was say 190, I think resale would be up around 300 right now. But with it being 250, they kind of bricked. They bricked pretty hard, especially on StockX. Probably get your size for under retail. If you want the shoe, right now is the time to go for it. I highly recommend you go for them now. You got this LeBron outsole. This is, I'm pretty sure the eight. I'm pretty sure it's a LeBron eight outsole. Uh, it could be the 9. I know the 8, 9, and 10 are all pretty much the same. They're very similar. But you definitely get that LeBron vibe. You got that air unit down here. I love the translucent black outsole. You guys can see it's clear right here. It's all black midsole. Then you got this black and clear upper. So it's like this plastic type material with a lot of ventilated patches along the toe section and up here as well. What that is for is you can wear like a different color of socks and it is see-through. You'll be able to see your red socks underneath, your orange socks, whatever it may be. And you can kind of give the sneaker your own little twist. Very dope. I love the concept behind it. Behind this is just the shoe. It's the leather underneath the only part that is transparent is the toe section i kind of wish it was up here and back here as well i think it would just look a little better nonetheless still very clean they did come out with a white colorway uh, about a year ago those i took the l on probably pick those up right now honestly i probably should because the price has gone down that is such a clean colorway i absolutely love that shoe i've heard these are super comfortable, super lightweight. I can tell this right there. Plus that eight uh, midsole and outsole, super comfortable. One of the best LeBrons out there. I mean, overall, this shoe is just like killing it. Performance, style, comfortability. You really aren't going wrong with this shoe. It's like a lifestyle shoe, but with that basketball touch to it, I, I definitely think you could ball in these. I don't see why not the outsole is good for it. There's not a crap ton of support up in the hill section, uh, especially if you're a point guard and you don't really need that, you like lower shoes anyway, then this is kind of perfect for you. Very light, lower to the ground, not super high, not super bulky and heavy. So it might be a good choice to try and ball. Uh, it looks dope. So, you know, look good, play good. Also, I forgot to say, this tongue is translucent as well. So you will be able to see a few colors through the laces, but the laces are mainly gonna be uh, hiding that. So you got black laces, you got that Nike swoosh up on the tongue, black lining, then you got your John Elliott LeBron, little circle on the insole, very dope. You got a small little pull tab in the back. I also forgot to mention you got a Nike swoosh on the toe section. If I had to pick one thing I didn't like about the sneaker, it would be the fact, and I already mentioned it, that it's just leather right here. It's not even transparent right in this section. I wish it was. And I also wish it wasn't two different like layers. I wish it was stitched in right here. I think it would just look better. That's my only pet peeve with the sneaker. Besides that, they absolutely killed it. The $250 
retail is kind of tough kind of hard to buy a pair of shoes at 250 uh, but i definitely think these are worth it i think they absolutely killed it i love these stripes running along here i think it's dope it gives a little bit of a shine as you turn the shoe so like i said on StockX, they are going for under retail so if you want them i definitely say get them now check them out i'm pretty sure they run true to size let me know what do you guys think of the shoe what do you think of john elliott do you think this was a good collaboration do you like the all black colorway what do you think of the translucent little areas up here let me know all that good stuff down below if you're new to the channel subscribe hit that like button if you like the content it's your boy reason kicks we out <laughs> Thank you.